Welcome, this is the Energy Vibration Reading for the Cancer Sun, Moon, and Rising. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Thank you for the wonderful energy. The energy of this month is an earth energy. It brings balance to so, um, situation in your life and all around you. So let's check out and see what is transpiring for you Cancers in the month of June. Happy birthdays, you Cancers. You Cancers are having your birthday. Happy birthday, happy birthday, you Kansas. Let's see what's coming up for the Kansas. Remember, there's an extended deal to this reading. Please like, share, and subscribe. Subscribe. First week, a lot of people are having strength. Whatever is transpiring for you, Kansas, a lot, a lot of people, a lot of other zodiac is coming out in the first week having strength because it's a month of balance. Oh, you have the devil, the first one to get the devil. Oh. You cancers, secrets, uh, you cancers. Ooh, the magician is going to help you resolve the situation. Ooh, ooh la la, you cancers. Fire, water, your third week is gonna be your best week. Fire and water, but the last week you're gonna be released out of this. Uh, um, it's as if people um, or situation hold you in a certain energy it's as if people and situation hold you in a certain energy and you are trying to find yourself to release yourself and whoever else this energy is that you are being um, um it's as if there are people that is holding you um is is trying to hold you or or um you know changing situation for you but this shit isn't going to work because the truth is going to come out strength let's see what is the energy of strength at work so some of you um cancer at work there's a devil energy at work and you're trying to find inner strength to deal with this situation the devil secrets is coming out yeah 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 uh-huh what else is happening love is going to be coming to you in the fourth week so whatever lies deception and and situation that has transpired at your work whatever lies deception and situation that transpires at your work you are carrying the energy of the four of cups it's as if you have something but there's one thing that is missing okay but at work you have some regrets but then all of a sudden new love is going to be coming in okay it's as if the ending going in um, the ending of June then all of a sudden new love is coming at you okay let's see what's happening with the devil and the eight of Pentacles and regrets the devil eight of Pentacles and regrets it has to do with a, a situation it is a karmatic situation that you're working out with people at your work it is definitely a karmatic situation that you're working out with people at your work what is the secret it's all about money all about money it's all about money all about money there is some deceptive move that is going on at your work for some of you it miss maybe it will happen but I, this is the reason for you to find out. and it has to do with the knight of pentacles whoever this knight of pentacles is is all about money don't trust this person whoever this person is all about money all about money um it's all about money don't trust this person walk away from this person if someone is coming in your life that is the knight of pentacles no don't trust this person walk away from this person do not have anything to do with this person so what we see in the first week is that you have to find inner strength to deal with the people on the work floor this is definitely a work floor situation that you're dealing with and you have to deal with and um, a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn but whatever the situation is it's all about money and love um, and you guys are going to be coming out on top okay there is some sadness and regrets that we're going to be looking at there's definitely some sadness and regrets that we're going to be looking at and uh, you need to know that that there is definitely some sadness and regrets so 
let's see the strength the eight of pentacles and the devil strength eight of pentacles and the devil um, this situation is giving you a lot of burdens you're carrying a lot of burdens especially at the workplace some of you some of you could be dealing with a Sagittarian or an Aries Ooh, an Aries oh god okay um, there is really this person but you're going to overcome this okay um, okay the devil the four of cups and the eye princess Ooh la la eight of pentacles at work so definitely it's a work situation again the eight of pentacles comes up it has something to do with work you have some regrets you really had some regrets about work now we have the eye princess the ace of cups and the magician I'm loving this with the eye princess the ace of cups and the magician yes you're gonna be victorious and successful yay <laughs> oh wow oh wow oh 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 yeah bam 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 so some of you were dealing with a situation at your work it could be an Aries some of you were dealing with some of you could be dealing with an um, a Sagittarius but these two the Aries and the Sagittarians try to place burden upon you at your work but you're coming out of this because you really had some regret that you had even talked to these people or connect with these people but you're going to be victoriously coming out of this because some one at your work there was some information that came in and they intercept the information and sold the information to someone and they're going to be found out what they did bam yeah 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 yep they intercept the information and ask you you know because you um <laughs> people between the ages of 18 and 45 you're dealing with an issue a family issue and you have escalate this family issue out to the workplace of either yourself or the family this was wrong keep your shit to yourself and not at a workplace okay and now what is transpiring what is happening um, we have the energy of the Knight of Pentacles and it's oh, you're gonna be receiving some money you guys so definitely okay you are going to be receiving some money and a lot of offers is going to be coming to you you are definitely going to be receiving some money and a lot of offers is going to be coming to you okay let's see the situation this night whoever you're dealing with that is a Taurus Virgo Capricorn between the age of 18 and 45 this this person is from a past life and it's all about money for this person yep justice comes down on this person <sighs> yes justice comes down on this person okay if some of you were dealing with um an Aquarian Gemini or Libra a heartbreaks is coming in and you are going to be walking away you're gonna be finding the strength to walk away so some of you um, that was dealing with an Aquarian Gemini or Libra there is definitely heartbreaks that is coming in and you are going to be walking away this is a lady 45 years and older and there's definitely heartbreaks that is coming in and you are going to be walking away okay so
So, let's get back to where we go. Sorry, I had to take that call. Very important. So, um, yeah, so you, you young men are carrying a burden, but justice is going to prevail, okay? So, um, you young men, whatever the situation is and whatever you have gotten yourself in, whether it was a work situation or a situation with past life people, you're carrying a burden and you're going to be released from this person, burden. A lot of opportunities are going to be coming in, whatever the situation is, whatever that is transpiring around you, a lot of opportunities is going to be coming in. And um, justice prevail. Justice prevail over someone that was a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn between the ages of 18 and 45 that has done you something injustice. It could be a situation where it has to do with money, where people were deceptively or deceptively as... Um, taken some money and this money is going to be returned to you definitely this situation is plain then I'm seeing the energy of the eye princess where secrets came out it's as if um, whatever that has transpired some secrets came out I'm seeing the end to the situation and a new beginning is going to be coming in because it's as if you had whatever it takes to release this information or to release the situation you have used it in the good right form and you have cut through whatever the BS was and you finally break through and now you're finding out the truth to a situation so justice prevail um, justice against an injustice situation that has transpired in your life I'm seeing money coming in because justice um, because of what injustice has transpired I'm seeing some money were being returned to you and um, this is going to be a, a really um, if you have a situation there's going to be offer of a new car if there was some unjust situation with a car I'm seeing there um, this dealer or auto people are going to be offering you um a new car okay so we have two energies and we have one energies two energies choose one of these energies and the one that you choose the first one is number 30 so the ascendance masters are definitely definitely here whatever is transpiring the ascendance masters is definitely here and number 88 so financial abundance is definitely going to be coming in for you guys so what we see here is object, objectively focused, uh, aboveness, illuminating the truth, okay? So it's as if you guys are going to be illuminating the truth about a situation that has transpired and you have illuminated the truth of what exactly has been transpired, what exactly has been happening um, and you could be finding out something that has been going on on the work floor for such a, a long time and you are going to be bringing this information to light. Then we have card number two and it's blue also. Um, so your color is going to be blue healing and it says choose positive thoughts that will um, um, chase us away um, chases away the devil so bring positive thoughts in your mind and as you do that you chase away the negative thoughts and um, you while you have positive thoughts you cannot um, have the energy of the negative okay because um, it is going to be helping you to balance out whatever is going on around you and this is going to be good let's look at your animal spirit guide or what is coming up Ooh, you have three animal spirit guide and they're saying going with a three so we have three animal spirit guide they really want to come out for you um, cancer so this is card one this is card um, two and three okay so we're looking at card one so choose one of these cards and now card one is number 50 so there's going to be transition the rhino energy and it says overcome any obstacles so for some of you out there whatever obstacles whatever you're working whatever you're um, um assisting and working on you're going to be definitely overcoming all the obstacles call upon the rhino energies um the the energy of the animal there the rhino to come in and move all the obstacles out of your life okay then we have the energy 
um, the peacocks, let it shine. Open up your behind and let it shine, ladies and gentlemen. Because trust me, you got what it takes to shine. So you cancers, you got to shine in this um, month because you have what it takes to shine. I'm seeing this is a situation that is happening on the work floor. And there was some deceptive situation that was playing on the work floor. And you are going to bring it to light. And then you're going to shine like you've never shined before. And this is going to be good. As we look at the situation, the last energy, the third energy is... Um, number 13 and it says the stag um spirit takes the lead take the lead so this is going to be wonderful it's actually going to be a very wonderful month for you um, um cancers because what is happening and what is transpiring is that the rhino energy is here and the peacock energy and there is something that has transpired on the work floor or in a past life a family issue and you're going to be taking the lead because justice is coming in here justice is definitely coming in here and you're going to be justified against this person whoever this person is um, um, it could be um, a, a, a whoever or whatever that was happening at your work it's as if you are going to be bringing the light to the situation and people are going to start to look at the situation there's going to be an investigation that is going to be happening and they're going to be finding out that you are right on the money okay they're going to be finding out that you're right on the money and what is going to be happening for you is that you are going to be getting the spotlight and you are going to be start taking the lead in um, a lot of stuff and people are going to be realizing that hey um wow this person is really really on target but everything is as if they see and between the illusions and it's as if you are going to be bringing down and breaking down the illusions and releasing and letting people see exactly what is happening and sometimes we we wonder why we get involved in certain situation but sometimes the universe send you to deal with certain situation because you are the one to um, break out and release and let people know exactly what is happening okay two last cards I have for you card one and card two is from the ascendance deck and this is hair and it says I invoke air to carry the angels singing around the world giving peace and you know it's good when you're outside walking or that sort of a thing that you said I invoke hair to carry angels singing around the world and bring hope and peace it is so wonderful to do this sort of a thing because what it does is that it brings in positive energies around you not only that what it really does it transpires the energy on this planet okay so this is really really wonderful then we have hair and fire and in um, the air energy comes up um, for you in um, in the last week and whew, whew, the, the third week is going to be your best week the third week is going to be your best week whatever is transpiring and happening the third week is going to be your best week fire transmutate the hold and t and take it to the new um to highly um frequency everything archangel gabriel's um supervisor of tone element master fire fire salamander and the fire dragon your guidance is to ask them to transmutate the energy of conflicts then spread peace warm and nourishing to people everywhere you can ask fire to help you eat the right food so that you can have the perfect fluid for your ascension journey it will also ignite your aura and keep your chakras fifth dimension glowing so that you can attract many others on your journey and this is so good I invoke fire to light my way to the new golden age isn't this wonderful very wonderful very positive very aligned this is good and I can say to each and every person thank you so much um, for returning to my channel for the extended of this reading um, please use the link below please like share these videos um, thumbs up 
and let people know thumbs up thumbs up and let people know about these um, videos um, check out the moon reading um, go and check out other readings for your partner your friends and that sort of a thing I want to say namaste until next time